I forgot to say, Ashley asked me to pass on a message. Could you meet her here when you get the chance? Hello and welcome to another episode of Game Systems TV here on Mixer. It's episode number seven and we decided to change it up a little bit today. Uh, we are doing Forza Horizon 2 instead of Borderlands 2 or Assassin's Creed Chronicles China. Uh, we've uh, decided to, uh, to to do a different game for a change. Um, this is quite a bit of a uh, challenging stream for me today. Uh, I've got to look after my kids as well as doing a stream. Uh, I've got a five-year-old, uh, sorry, five-year-old, five-month uh, son. Uh, and uh, he was asleep when I started doing this. He's just started to wake up. So I'm just trying to settle him down. So bear with me a minute. And also I've got a three-year-old daughter as well who's uh, occupied by watching Ben and Helly. Uh, ben and Ben and Holly on Nick Jr. at the moment. So uh, she's she's all right. My son's just stirring at the moment. <laughs> so just setting him down and then I could get on the stream. Uh, thanks for those of you who have uh, joined us here on Mixer for this episode of Game Systems TV of Forza Horizon 2. Unfortunately, I can't get anyone involved in the stream today because I don't have Xbox Live Gold. It's ran out. Um, unfortunately, it's, I found out yesterday. I had a little play on the game yesterday because obviously it's been a while since I played Forza Horizon 2. It's even been a while, well, a couple of weeks since I went on Xbox Live. And um, fortunately, my gold has run out, so I can't do anything like online gaming at the moment. So I'm actually stuck offline. So this stream is just going to be purely uh, Forza Horizon 2 offline. I really wanted to get online on this, but unfortunately, it is just going to be offline. Otherwise, I won't be able to bring you a stream today. So I thought, oh, well, I've. And luckily, I haven't got gold, but I can still do a stream and show you guys a bit of Forza Horizon 2 here on Mixer. Uh, it's the first time we've done Forza Horizon 2 here on Mixer. We have done it previously on Twitch, on our Twitch channel, twitch.tv forward slash game systems TV, if you want to check out our Twitch channel. And uh, yeah, unfortunately, like I said, we ran out of gold. Now, I had a bit of a uh, situation yesterday when uh, I was playing this game I said I wasn't playing it online, I was playing it offline, but someone managed to message me here on Xbox Live. Um, one second, I can get the message up. It's very random. And I don't even know who the person is. Uh, this is the messages I received yesterday. Uh, I won't give out the gamer tags, obviously, for privacy reasons I obviously won't say that the gamer tag or the person who it is uh, but they messaged me saying hey and I said hey how are you doing and they said found you on friend search here on the Xbox app I was bored and looking for a guy or gal to make rage quit he he and I was and then uh, I said rage quit what and they said I'm 24 female by the way you hope you don't mind me asking your gender lol and I said, I'm a 32-year-old male. And she said, ah, I just got done playing Overwatch, lol. I'm still in school. College, that is right now. So now is the time that I'm really enjoying myself, you know. And I uh, didn't message back. I was like, what the hell is this about? So I ignored it. She had a message back saying, hey, you still around? And I said back... I am, but not for much longer. I've got to do my daughter's breakfast. Uh, she then goes... Oh, hang on. I'll just come off messages. She then goes... So... Um, so I I know we're total strangers, and this is random, but can I trust her? And I said, I, ho I would hope so, as I'm an, almost a middle-aged man, and not an immature teenager. She said, lol, so I was actually going to get my job here shortly. A friend of mine was working online, and I kept asking her about it, so she showed me what she was doing when she got back to school last spring semester. I thought, I, uh, I thought she was out of her mind at first, lol, but 
was pretty cool actually. But it's pretty cool actually. We work online doing private webcam shows, which sounded super odd at first, but trust me, I freaking love it. And I being a bit like uh I try to be a bit like, you know, all, all the innocent and all that and go, Oh yeah, what what webcam shows do you do? Not being any pervy or anything like that. I'm just trying to get her to say what the hell she's doing, you know, see if she would actually admit to what I think she's doing on these webcam shows. So I said, what webcam shows do you do? Thinking that maybe it might be innocent gaming webcam shows. You know, thought I'd find out. Don't want to just think the worst of people. So I thought I'd ask. Uh, she said, well, what I was going to say is I have some free passes and I usually just do private shows before I get started to warm up, lol. Uh, no one is online... So, uh, no one is online so, though, so I thought I was going to give you one of the passes uh, if you wanted. Uh, you can give me a really good rating so I can get more if you do, though, okay? And then I was like, what the hell is this about? So I turned my Xbox off. I was like, why? I'm not even going to make myself look online here. I really should go away. I turned my Xbox off. I turned it back on again today to do the stream and there's a message waiting for me saying where are you <laughs> and still she hasn't messaged me back since so i've got away with it i don't know what the hell that was about i don't want to see any private webcam shows thank you very much like i said i'm a ma male in his 30s i've i'm married with two kids i'm not into that kind of webcam pervy webcam shows uh, i've never ever seen a webcam show not even when I was younger, not even 10 years ago, or, you know, when I was actually in my teens and stuff, there probably wasn't all that webcam shows about, you know, when I was in my teens, it was, oh, Christ, when, well, I entered my teens in uh, 1998, so, you know, late 90s, early noughties, I was a teenager, so there wasn't all that kind of webcam show stuff about then, so... Yeah, they had phones, mobile phones then, but there was no cameras on a mobile phone, so there wasn't even any of taking pictures and sending these kind of pictures, you know, like they do these days, you know, what the kids do and that. God, give me something to worry about when I'm older anyway, when I've got my uh, my two that when they get older. And um, bear me one second, my boy is awake. And he's stirring in his cot. Trying to settle him down a minute. Normally when I do a stream, um, I'm either in the office or I'm at home. Today I'm at home because I have to look after the kids because uh, my wife's gone off and doing some hair and makeup for photo shoots and stuff today. So uh, a little business stuff that she does. I'll, I'll plug her a little business. You can check her out on Facebook. It's uh, Wonderland Hair and Beauty. Uh, search for that on Facebook. And you'll find it if you want some uh, stuff done. Or if you want to see the kind of stuff that she's done. Uh, yeah, if, for weddings and stuff like that. Uh, you can find all pictures and stuff on the Facebook page. If you enjoy it, uh, then yeah, you can book her uh, through Facebook. Now then, I'm going to quickly move on. Because I'm going to get on to this because the day is getting on and the kids are starting to stir and they're going to want my attention so um right i'm trying to think what to do next uh yeah for those of you watching us on mixer right now please feel free to get involved in the stream uh in, in the chat i should say more precisely um yeah get involved in the chat i'd love to hear from you guys anything you want to say or talk about or chat to me like i said I've, the only person in the room with me right now is my five month old son who cannot talk so i can't have a chat with him but i wouldn't mind talking to you guys if there's anything that you want to talk about any topics you want to talk about whether it's the game the stream or anything like that or if you just want to say hi just give me a shout out hi and you know, I'll give you a shout out in the chat as well so please feel free to get involved in the chat today uh, for those of you that are watching live on Mixer right now for those of you who are not watching live and you're watching this on YouTube on our brand new well we branded I should say uh, YouTube channel which is game systems on demand or game systems OD as the channel is called um, 
you can, like I said, get involved in the comment section of this video. Please feel free, obviously, to leave your comments for this video at uh, any point of this video. You don't have to wait till the end of the video. You can leave it in the first 10, 15 minutes at the moment. We're 12 minutes through the video at the moment. So 13 minutes now. It's just turned 13 minutes. So there are 13 minutes through the video right now. So if you want to get involved uh, in the comment section, then please feel free obviously, to leave your views or comments in the comment section of this video and also please feel free to obviously to give it a thumbs up if you like this video and also share it as well we greatly appreciate to all the exposure that our videos get on YouTube so please feel free obviously to get um, like I said leave your comments and like and share this video right then I'm going to swiftly move on. Oh, yeah. I'll just something before I go. Um, I'm just going to go through some deals here that we've got on our website at uh, gamesystems.co.uk. Uh, Grand Theft Auto 5 is currently on offer from only $14.99. Uh, it's on Xbox 360, PS3, Xbox One, and PS4. On Xbox 360, it's $19.99. On PS3, it's $14.99. Xbox One is $19.99. And for some reason, these do the price, and I don't know what's going on here. But um, it's $29.99 on PS4. I think the price in, uh, from Rockstar is higher on PS4 because it's a more popular platform. Therefore, they make more money on that platform. That's why they charge a higher price. And therefore, if we get charged a higher trade price, we have to charge a higher retail price. Unfortunately, that's how it works. And it's also the same on Amazon as well. I can't quite see what the price is on Amazon at the moment. But I know that for some reason the PS4 price on Amazon is higher than the Xbox One price. Uh, Dirt 4 is also on offer at the moment. We've got 10% off that. It's just $44.99 on Xbox One and PS4. Uh, FIFA 17 is also on offer. We're dropping this down because next month FIFA 18 comes out. So, you know, we've got loads of copies of FIFA 17 to get shot off basically before FIFA 18 comes out. So, you can get FIFA 17. For just 14, well, I should say from only 14.54 on Xbox 360, PS3, Xbox One, and PS4. It's 14.54 on Xbox 360 and PS3, and £17.30 on Xbox One and PS4. These prices are even cheaper than Amazon. I have already checked. Uh, Ghost Recon Wildlands is another game we've got an offer, 25% off. It's just 39, sorry, 33.99 on Xbox One and 48.99 on PS4. One second, I'm trying to find this Mario Kart 8 Deluxe as well. Where is it? I'm trying to find it on the website. Hang on. Uh, yeah, Mario Kart 8 Deluxe on the Switch. You never find this price any cheaper anywhere else. It is the cheapest I've ever seen this game anywhere in the world. It is currently £22.14 on the Switch. That is one of the cheapest Switch games I've actually come across so far. And it's Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. It ain't no cheap game. It is, you know, this game, I'll tell you... I'll well, I'll tell you how much it is worth. Uh, I'll go on to um, Amazon and see how much Amazon set it for. Now, Amazon set it for £42. You're getting it nearly £20 cheaper on our website. Now, it doesn't matter whether you're in the UK or anywhere else in the world. You can actually buy this game for the Switch from our website here at gamesystems.co.uk. The good news about it is that the Switch is region free, so you can actually get a PAL region uh, Switch game from here in the UK, and it should still work you know, in America, Australia, Germany, places like that. It should still work, hence why it being region free. So go and check out these deals on our website at gamesystems.co.uk. If you want more information about it or if you want to see more deals, then uh, go and check it out. It's all on the home page. Uh, if you want to purchase it as well, you'll find them on the home page. Just click on them, add to your cart, and then check out. And obviously you can get them for those prices. 
and I will crack on with the game of Forza Horizon 2, which you guys have tuned in for and patiently waiting for me to play. Right. Let's go. And I'm in the wrong car, by the way. I don't even know. I was tinkering around with this last time I played it. I was doing some more um, tweaks to the, the car. Right. I'm so actually in the wrong car. I should be in this car. I probably will do a bit of talking over top of the music. Uh, reason being is because copyright laws having this on YouTube, they moan and they try and ban the video from countries because of music. It's, it's pathetic. I can play this on Mixer. It's not a problem. If I can give this guy a race, he's a D class. I think I'm a D class. Should be fairly matched. We'll to see. I did race an A class car yesterday in this, and uh, I beat it. Right, he's already got a head start. Whoa. It's a bit reckless driving here just to uh, try and pull away from him. This is the only like, kind of racing I can do against someone uh, because I'm offline. I can only be offline, which sucks. And unfortunately, you guys can't get involved in a live chat uh, with me here on Mixer because like I, said, I don't have gold at the moment. I will get that sorted for the next stream, though. Turn left. Ah. I shouldn't have done that. I should have just cut straight across there. Oh, that, what a stitch. Oh my god, that is an absolute stitch. No, 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 no. I'm not losing this. I'm not losing this because of that. The guy just drove straight into the front of me. That was deliberate to try and slow me down and make me lose this. Turn right. Ah, no. I don't know what I was thinking. It's still, I think I've still managed to pull this off. There's no modifications on this car. I've got a completely standard Acura NSX. And I actually did manage to, <laughs> to pull it off. Do a little bit of driving around, see what, what, what I can find. Uh, I have got a little mission thing to do. I might do this as I'm offline, so. Keeps me busy, otherwise, I'd be kept busy with online racing. Unfortunately, I don't have any online racing to do. The calm to have it online. Straight. Being is because uh, the Cura is like a uh, American version of Honda, isn't it? Really? Oh, to be honest, right, let's pull up, let's have a look, let's have a look for things to do. Oh, there's a little board thing there. I think I'll do the board and then I'll do that little uh, parking thing there, that little parking sign there. Turn around when it is safe to do so. 
That's another part of our offline mission left. kind of objective kind of stuff. I have been smashing through all the boards just to uh, yeah, give me some more XP and some fast travels I can do, which wouldn't cost me any money or any credits, I should say. Did slightly turn the wrong direction uh, at the start there. So I know it's been a couple of weeks since the last stream when we did Borderlands 2 and unfortunately it was just me playing through Borderlands 2. There's no me speaking, it was just pure gameplay. Uh, so what have you guys been up to in the last couple of weeks? Uh, please feel free to let me know in the chat or uh, talk about uh, the last couple of weeks when any eventful things have happened. Uh, me, myself, I haven't really been up to much. Last weekend was my wife's birthday so we went out. Uh, and celebrated that. And some Mexican food at, Ch at Chiquitos. Kind of Mexican food. She had fajitas and I had a steak. In 400 so meters, turn right. I tend to stick to what I know. They did have burritos on it, and I was like, what the hell is a burrito? Turn right. <laughs> and I never had a burrito. I haven't even had tacos. Meters, like, ah, they're all on the, right. the menu, and I haven't even tried them. It's not that I wouldn't try them, it's just that I would try them if I wasn't paying for them. Right. My son's proper woke up now and he's stirring in his car like now. There, there we go. Fast travel board. It's only 31 out of 50, there's still loads more to get. There's like 19 more to get. Right, one second, I'm going to sort him out. He's sorted. Well, for now, anyway. Uh, let some uh, dance music on. I know I'm going to get in trouble with copyright and stuff like that for playing this kind of music. Now I'm going to get my video banned on YouTube, it just happens every time I do a Forza Horizon stream. Music, well, the videos can tend to get banned. I put one up once and it got banned in over 200 countries because of the music. I was like, I can't help that, it's part of the game. But they wouldn't have it, I did dispute it with YouTube and they wouldn't have it. So uh, the dispute stood and my video to this day is still banned on YouTube. But with this new upload feature on Twitch, sorry Mixer you haven't got this yet, maybe you want to think about it, uh, I can re-upload it onto Twitch so you guys can check it out because Twitch aren't that anal about right, like YouTube are. Right, I'm going the completely wrong direction as I've just found. I'm going to go here. It's Turn a little car meet. So, so I'm going to head back. Four's going the right way. I just realised I was going the wrong way, so I'd get the map back out again. Hang on a minute. Is there any cars I can race? Way back, there was someone who's just gone down that way. When it is safe to do so. and I ain't racing him either because of the car he's got. Oh, yeah, there's two in front. What's uh, what have they got? There's three in front. Hey, hey, sit. Turn around. Where are you going? When it is oh, safe to do so. there's a little uh. Beat. I'll race that one. 
Yes. Oh, yes. Look at that. I should beat this. Easy. Oh, he almost went the wrong way. Was that sign in the middle of the road, or was there something I couldn't see? It doesn't look like the sign was sat there, right in the middle of the road. Turn right. As as done as I wanted to. Point. In Fortunately, meters, I could do it better first. if I had a, uh, yeah, a car that could do that kind of stuff better. Remember this is pretty standard. He's miles behind. Left. Oh no. Oh no. I should not have done that. I've done that on purpose. That's turning. Yeah okay I've lost a bit of speed but at least I haven't gone past the turning. I'll we'll have to go right back. Hi Winter Spy, how you doing? Thanks for tuning into the stream today. Hello good people, Scott, Ty Scott Tyler here in a very good mood. And why would that be, you ask? Well, have you seen the weather? That was easy. Pay attention to the difficulty rating of festival oh, races shush. before you challenge them. Higher difficulty ratings mean bigger payouts. Of course I'm going to go for someone Which who's European rated lower than me because I stand a chance of winning. Only you had a road trip to go on. Um, hmm. Good to hear that you're good, Winter Spy. I'm good as well. Uh, as I said earlier in the stream, because I don't think you might have been watching then, um, I'm having to look after my kids today while doing the stream, so this could be very challenging for me. Not only am I playing the game, obviously keeping an eye on the, the chat, as well as keeping an eye on the two kids as well. And they say men can't multitask. Uh, what level am I on? You'll find out one second. I'll get up on the screen now. There you go. 62. Not very high. It has been a few months since I played this. Um, whenever people ask me what level I'm on, they tend to be on a much higher level than me. Uh, so what level are you on then, Winter Spy? I'm sure you're on a higher level than I am. 162. <laughs> you want 100 levels more than me. When it is safe to do so. Yeah, I know. I'm miles behind. It's because I don't play it a lot. I don't play it enough, I should say. I do streams of it, but not very often. It's the first stream I've done of Forza Horizon 2 in about three or four months. So, and it is also the same amount of time since I last played this game as well. Calculating route. In 400 meters, turn right. I'm not even following the sun now, I'm just going to go uh, my own way. I'm just going to go for a little right. drive. It's night, why not? And there's loads of cars sat in my way. Oh, I've taken the damage off. I remember uh, racing with some people online and uh, they said, oh, I'll turn the damage off because uh, well, they were messing around and they were smashing my car up and they were like, oh, I'll just take the damage off. Which I have done and I haven't put back on. So. I don't know. Uh, hey, Winter Spy, have you, um, what, do you prefer your damage on or off? Have you got your damage on or off for your cars? So I, I, t I like my damage on, but I've been so. told to turn the damage off only when I was playing online. And I've just left it off. It's just like it adds a bit more realism in the league on. To my opinion. Um, Winter Spice says that he's going to um, friend me. Do you need the gamer tag or have you seen what the gamer tag is? And for anyone who's watching, I do encourage people to add me as a friend. So if you do want to add me as a friend, uh, the gamer tag is Sonic Pain 24. Uh, one second, I'll get it up on the screen now. There it is in the top right hand corner. You see it? 
That's, how, that's how you spell it. it safe to do so. Oh look, there's that beat watch just beat. Now, I don't know how many people still play Forza Horizon 2. Obviously, Forza Horizon 3 has been out for nearly a year now. So, people have moved on to Forza Horizon 3. I haven't yet, and I haven't actually done a stream, but I still like Forza Horizon 2. I can't put the game down at the moment. Well, I have for a few months, but racing games, this is the only game I've been playing. Uh, I've moved on from the motorsport games. I will you know, go back to them, because obviously we've got Forza Motorsport. 7 coming out in October and uh, we will be streaming that game once it comes out in 400 meters, turn as well as Forza Horizon 3 as well, we've got to do that oh we might do that first actually nah, you know what I might just follow it back I think I'm getting a bit too far away from where I want to be And you can also see that I do have a standard car. I do have some modified cars and better cars than just a RSX, but I just so happen to be potting around in the RSX at the moment, a standard one of that. I went to the same, it's so fun. Yeah, I do, I love Forza Horizon 2. I think I prefer playing Forza Horizon 2 than Forza Motorsport 6, I should say. I don't know if I'm going a bit too far with that comment, but <laughs> I do prefer Forza Horizon 2 over Forza, Horizon, uh, Forza Motorsport 6. But I do like Forza Motorsport 5 though, I should say. I did, did enjoy playing that game, I did miss playing that game actually, and uh, might venture back to doing more streams on Forza Motorsport 5 at one stage, but. I'm going to do the Forza Horizons first. In 400 meters, bear right. Keep right. In 400 meters, There's turn no point me racing right. him either because uh, I will get beat. No, he's already pulling away from me already. I'm not even racing him. Ah, he's gone now. In 400 meters, turn right. Turn right. I'm too busy not looking where I'm going. I almost passed that turn again. Now this is a little um, kind of race meetup that is very early on in the game, but as I have been mainly doing online racing, and unfortunately, like I said earlier, my uh, at your destination. where is it? Oh, it's up there. Uh, like I said, my gold's ran out, so I can't do any online racing at this present time, but I will do very soon. Once I get gold sorted out, but that'll be in the next stream. So for now, I'm just, uh, just doing um, the offline kind of car meets and stuff like that. been to a car meet before this is the kind of place you can always find a race if that's your thing i like to come to just meet new people and talk cars swap tuning tips check out paint jobs whatever oh hold on sorry gotta go duty calls but feel free to just hang out you never know who you're gonna meet i'll see you later
Right, I've been to car meets for real, but I've never actually been to a car meet on a game before. Everyone's price that didn't show up. Um, what's that? The the game tag didn't show, up, or the 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 friend invite you mean didn't show up? Looks a bit like a, a Lotus. Oh, the gamer tag. Uh, you couldn't find the gamer tag, is it? Um, bear me one second. I'll uh, see if I can get it up again. I've got to come off this one sec. I go back here. There we go. There, that's my gamer tag. There. Uh, is if you do it in a capital S, then a space, capital P, and then 24, which is joins the end. So if you type it in exactly how it is there on the screen, uh, you should be able to find it. If you have found it, just let me know. Oh, there's two cars just turned up in that time. What have we got here? A mini. Oh, can you buy the cars off people or what? Now, if I was to buy a car for someone, I don't know which car to get. I've got plenty of money, I ain't got to worry about that. It's just uh, to uh, work out which car would be the best to get. Uh, when a spy seems to have done it, he says he found it. It may be you might have done, got the capitals or didn't put the space in the right place. Um, you, if you did it all in one kind of tag writing kind of thing, uh, you won't find there is a space between Sonic and Pain. Now thanks for the follow uh, Winter Spy, really appreciate that. for it. Well, the tune's unavailable, the design is available. Don't have a mini, I don't think. I have to check my own cards. I can't even remember what cards I've got. Normally, um, for Forza Motorsports or Forza... Well, I can't say Forza Horizons because I have got the first one, I haven't played the first one, but mainly for the Forza Motorsports, I do a list of the cars that I've got, so I can actually just revert to the list and have a look and go if I've got that car or not. Uh, unfortunately, I haven't put any of my cars down, so I don't know what I've got and what I haven't got. Especially when I haven't played the game for about three or four months, I cannot remember.
Oh. I was just about to look at his car and he drove off. Never mind. There seems to be cars coming and going by the looks of it. This makes my mind even harder to make up with regards to should I buy someone's car off them or not. And obviously what car to get. I've got to make it up quick because the car might end up driving off and then I won't get to buy it. nothing available, there's no design available or tune available for this, so it probably is just a standard uh, Honda S2000. I wouldn't mind having one of these in real life, I don't know why, I've, I've got a thing for the S2000, I wouldn't mind at least driving one for real anyway, at least. I do own a Honda myself, but this is in real terms, not game terms, but it's a Honda Jazz I drive in real life, or in other countries known as a Honda Fit. Here in the UK it's a Honda Jazz. Still a good car though, I do enjoy it, it's a really good car. Station of the Horizon Festival. Now, for real, I saw an Abarth 500. Now, you know you can get the Abarth 500s. I saw one at a garage here in the UK, uh, second hand for. I think it was like six grand. A bar 500 for six grand. My Honda Jazz cost more than that. My Honda Jazz cost me eight grand. But it probably has got more stuff on it than what the uh, the uh, uh, bar 500 has. Not bad looking uh, Clio, but I'm not into French cars. Now, I've owned French cars, for real, uh, and they're not built very good at all. Anyone who owns a French car would know that they're not <laughs> built very well at all. They're like falling apart and making creaks and cracks and stuff like that. When, when you open the doors, they do the cracking noise when you open the doors because the hinges are just cheaply done and... Oh, French cars, ugh. They look alright, but they're built really bad. Myself, I tend to prefer the Japanese or German cars. I want an Italian one. I haven't had an Italian car before. I have driven an Italian car. I've driven a Ferrari F430 around the Silverstone track. Never owned an Italian car.
That's my type of cars, look. Honda. I love the new Civic. Anyone seen the 2017 Civic? I really do like that Civic Type R. If I had 30 grand in uh, UK money, then yes, I would definitely buy one. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have 30 grand to spend on a uh, Honda Civic. Last one in this list there is a Alfa Romeo. How do you sell that? Uh, say that, I mean. Uh, Giletta? 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 Oh, oh, I don't know. I'm not even going to say it. It's an Alfa Romeo. That's what it is. have a message being sent to me from uh, Winter Spy. I have got a message Winter Spy. I will uh, look at that in a minute. Right. Oh, what was there? It's gone. Oh, look, a couple of new cars have uh, arrived. Wow, Nissan Duke. Didn't even know the Duke was in this game. Oh, I haven't really looked at all the cars on this game, so like, well, I didn't know, but now I know. I don't really like these cars, to be honest. There's something weird about them. Now this model of the Duke, I'm not really a fan of, but the the newer model, the the um, the, uh, what's, what's, what's it called, a facelift model, uh, is better. It does look much better. My car then. Here's my car. It's a standard Acura RSX Type S. If I knew what this was about, I would have bought a better car. Don't you? I don't think I've got a better car actually. Wow, it's got a CD player and a tape player. It's 
Must be like an early noughties uh, model of a QRSX. Um, early to mid noughties, I should say. Um. Look at this. Nice looking monster Civic. Tries to buy the car. Oh, it's almost like a Borderlands one. Although I'd have to buy the car and then get the design off them. Oh, I don't know if I'm involved with that. Actually, I thought I could buy the car with the design on it. Um, the design is unavailable, so if I buy this car, I can't even get this design. Watch me, watch you. It's a shame you can't challenge any of them to the base. Yeah, you can have a look at their cars and stuff, but you can't actually challenge them to a base. This hey, is a bit of a shame. We're going to be hosting a new tournament on Isola della Tempesta. It's going to be more extreme than anything we've done so far, and we have some all new event types. Are you in? As you may have noticed, Isola della Tempesta is home to its own tropical subclimate. We'll be seeing storms like this pretty regularly throughout the season. It's a very different set of challenges from anything we've faced so far. Combine that with some really harsh and rugged terrain, and I think you'll start to get the idea of why we're here. No, I do not want the Storm Island pack. Not for fifteen ninety nine. All right. They do have, have offers, and it I is cheaper. To get involved with. Get yourself oh, over to Nice what? Harbour and bring an overnight bag. I'll see you there. Well, I ain't doing Storm Island. I'm not. I don't have that pack. I said, change my mind. I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to do that. I'm gonna get do a little bit of driving around first. One of Horizon's top drivers is nearby. I've marked their position on your GPS if you want to challenge them. Let's try one of these. Try against the Duke. Hey, it seems like he's got some performance mods on. Oh, oh, oh yes! And he's crashed. That was very tight. I managed to slip in there quickly before he did. Kind of pushed him out of the way of that. And uh, yes, I've won another one. I just sound stupid. Like that. Sir? At the roundabout, take the second exit. Oh. I'm actually trying to go round the roundabout like a normal roundabout. It doesn't matter, it's a game, just drive straight across it. Oh, 
Ah, oh, almost on 63. Something a bit different. A bit of like rock music. Now this would be too easy. That's just too easy. I'll probably get told off again. I'm betting the speed trap, I was drifting at the time. Camera right on a bend. I ain't gonna catch people speeding putting a camera on a bend. Stormwind's up ahead. I might get the expansion pack. I haven't actually been encouraged to get it yet. Now that I see this is available on the map, I might actually be more encouraged to get the Storm Island DLC pack. Some people have said don't bother getting it, it's rubbish. But when it's on offer, you can actually get it for about three or four pounds actually, instead of fifteen ninety nine. So I might check it out. A little board. In 100 meters, turn right. Horizon excess. In 200 meters, turn left. Turn left. In 200 meters, turn right. Turn right. In 200 meters, turn left. Turn left. You have arrived at your destination. There it is. You leveled up. Oh, yeah. Right, I'll do a spin. I wonder if it's a car or money. Car or money. Money. Oh, I thought I had another spin. I suppose they told me about another spin earlier. Actually, I might just go. <laughs> Change my mind again. I'm going to go this way. Oh yes, another bit of drum and bass. That's my kind of music. Drum and bass. Oh, who's this up ahead? Is it worth challenging? Oh Christ, probably not. I'm gonna lose this one. Oh, he was going to go left there, and I thought, yes. I'm 
definitely gonna happen. Let's see if he's gonna find a quicker way. In 400 meters, turn right. Just clip that car. He just left him out for me. This is uh, let me catch up a bit. No, 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 go away. Go away. Oh, he's beat me. Oh, he's going to beat me now. Unless there's any shortcuts, which I don't think so. Oh, God. Oh, God. I was too busy looking on the map. The shortcuts. I'm trying to find a shortcut. It's the only way I'm going to beat him. Yeah, I might be able to jump that van about. Because I'm too far away from him, so I don't think it's going to make much difference. The roundabout, take the second exit. The roundabout goes straight across. He still beat me. Yeah. Oh, there he is. He's uh, gone the same way. I ain't challenging him again. I look a bit stupid. It's a shame I can't do any online racing. I don't mind it, but it's not my uh, gold ran out. Okay, this is Chris Goss on hospital. Coming to you live from the beautiful Italian countryside where it's raining. <laughs> I didn't put that in the brochure. I could have stayed in London for this. Well, hope the weather isn't dampening your fun. Keep it here for music to keep your spirits up. Hospital records. Alright, I'm just going to pull over a minute. Because that is the end of part one of our stream. I've got to go and check on my kids. One of them is asleep and the other one has gone quiet. So I'm going to go and check on what she's doing. It's, uh, it's probably up to no good. Or she's fallen asleep herself. Um, it's been about an hour since I last checked on her. So I'd best go and uh, find out what she's up to. Uh, but thanks ever so much for you guys that have uh, tuned in to watch uh, Game Systems episode of um, Forza Horizon 2 here on Mixer. Uh, it's our seventh episode of uh, Mixer here. So I um, greatly appreciate uh, you guys that tune in, watch the streams, follow the channel and support the channel and streams. We uh, I said, greatly appreciate all that. Uh, for those of you that are watching live right here on Mixer and you're enjoying the stream so far and you want to see more from Game Systems TV in the future, then why not check out our Mixer channel? It's mixer.com forward slash Game Systems TV. Go and check it out. I'm not quite sure if Borderlands 2 is still up there. No, it's gone. Uh, Borderlands 2 has now been taken off of our channel. Uh, unfortunately, there is no videos to go and check out. But uh, this will be up on our Mixer channel as soon as this stream is done. So if you do want to go and see it from the very beginning, uh, wait to the end or come back in about an hour or two to the channel and go and check out this stream from the very beginning. Uh, there's also other stuff you can check out on our channel. There's also other stuff about us and the kind of stuff that uh, we do here on Mixer. Uh, so please feel free, obviously, to go and check out the channel. Like I said, it's mixer.com forward slash Game Systems TV. If you want to check out other streams that we were doing before we come over to Mixer, we still do this as well. You can go and check out our Twitch channel, twitch.tv forward slash Game Systems TV. Go and check out all the streams that we've done in the past that are in our highlights section. So when you go on our channel, click on highlights, and you'll find the videos that we've uh, put 
in the highlight session the best streams of Game Systems TV uh, from 2016 and early 2017. Now, although we do streams on Mixer now, we still go back and do streams on Twitch. So please feel free to go and follow our Twitch channel and uh, support us on Twitch. We will be doing some more streams on Twitch uh, later this month. Like I said, at the moment we're doing Mixer and it's like the first time that we've been doing streams on Mixer. It's the first time we've brought Forza Horizon 2 to Mixer. Uh, the other Forza Horizon 2 streams that we've done in the past have been on Twitch. So if you want to check out more Forza Horizon 2 or what we've been doing in the past on Forza Horizon 2, then you can go and check us out on our Twitch channel, twitch.tv forward slash game systems TV. And also, why you there, why not follow the channel as well and support our channel? And I said, when we do actually do uh, streaming back on Twitch again, which I've said before will be earlier, uh, sorry, later this month, then you'll get a notification as to when we go live. Now you can also check us out on YouTube as well. So if you do watch Mixer but don't watch Twitch, if you watch Twitch but don't watch Mixer, obviously we don't play or do the same stuff on either platform. Uh, you can go and check us out on YouTube. Therefore, every time we finish streams, whether it's on Mixer or Twitch, we upload it all onto YouTube. So there's YouTube, so there's Mixer and Twitch streams all on our YouTube channel. It's getting confusing me to say. So hopefully you guys are keeping this, keeping up with this. Uh, but like I said, you miss out on any episodes of Game Systems TV, whether it's on Mixer or Twitch subscribe to us on YouTube and every time we upload the latest videos from our latest streams then we will get the information as to when we've done that and so go into your subscriptions click on uh, any of the game systems OD streams that you see or videos that you see click on them and you can watch them uh, like I said please feel free to obviously to subscribe to us on YouTube it's youtube.com forward slash game systems OD now we used to be called just game systems on YouTube we just recently rebranded to OD OD stands for on demand so you can watch our streams on demand so though they're not live to you they are recorded live so you can watch them as and when you want to. You can watch them on the go. They will be a bit long to watch on YouTube, so make sure you have a lot of data because it will take a lot of data. Some of them are a bit small, so you can actually go and check them out there. There are some that are about half an hour to 45 minutes long, so you can check them out with, with data if you've got three or four gig of data. If you've got any more than that, then these longer streams are obviously better to watch. Or you can watch them on your phone if you're at home. Um, watch them on the consoles anywhere you can get the YouTube app uh, you can check out our videos so like I said please feel free to support us on YouTube by subscribing to our YouTube channel if you want to get the latest videos from Game Systems TV uh, they will be uploaded onto our YouTube channel it's youtube.com forward slash Game Systems OD Right, you can also check us out on social media. We're on Facebook. It's facebook.com forward slash Game Systems UK. If you want to check out uh, all the latest information with regards to the world of gaming, uh, any deals or stuff like that that we put up on our YouTube, sorry, on our Facebook page. There's so much stuff to say. I'm getting all mixed up. Uh, you can check us out facebook.com forward slash Game Systems UK. Go and give us a follow or like our page. Uh, you can also check us out on uh, Twitter as well as twitter.com forward slash Game Systems UK. Same stuff you can find on our Twitter page as you can find on Facebook. So if you've got Facebook and Twitter, please feel free to follow us on both. Or if you've got one or the other, please follow us on either platform that you have. Uh, like I said, similar stuff you can find on our Twitter page as you can find on our Facebook page. And we also have uh, a game which we play, which is Guess the Game. We upload some pictures of a game that we're playing. And all you need to do is guess the game. The first correct answer will win 2% off of their order at gamesystems.co.uk. Though it's a bit of fun, you do actually save some money just by doing, you know, by getting involved with playing it. Some of the games we make easy, some of the games we make hard. Uh, some of the clues can be in the hashtags we use. Uh, so it would be a hashtag of a platform that it's on. All you need to do is kind of, it will help you work out which platform, sorry, which game it is by the platform it's on. Uh, the latest one we've just done that uh, someone's got right was We Fit. 
And if there is other games that look similar to that last time, we fit. There is we fit and we fit plus. So you need to be precise into what you're guessing. If you guess we fit and it's we fit plus, you won't win. You have to say we fit plus if, it, if you think it is we fit plus. So make sure you get it right. Obviously, the, the exact one. Like I say, if you see this on there, you go, yes, Forza Horizon. Or which one? Forza Horizon, Forza Horizon 2, Forza Horizon 3. You need to make sure you guess the right you know, one in the series, I should say. Right then, for those of you watching live on Mixer right now, please feel free to get involved with the chat. Winter Spy has done, and he's also followed us on Mixer, which we greatly appreciate. So thanks ever so much for Winter Spy getting involved in the chat today and also following us. So we greatly appreciate it, and we even said so to him. So anyone that does want to get involved in the chat today, they want to have a chat with me, or they want to talk about um, the game, the stream, or any other thing to do in the world of gaming, please feel free, to, or like I said, even get, say hi in the chat, or whatever you want to say in the chat, please feel free to get involved in the chat, we greatly appreciate it and welcome it here at Game Systems TV. For those of you that are watching on YouTube, just because you're not watching it live doesn't mean you can't get involved in the comment section of this video. Anything you want to say, any comments you want to leave with regards to this video or the stream or anything or there's a comment you want to leave to me in order for me to answer, then please feel free obviously to get involved in the comment section of this video. And if you are enjoying this video, please give it a thumbs up, so give it a like. And also share it as well. We greatly appreciate all the exposure that our videos get on YouTube, and you can help us out just by sharing it um, with friends, family, subscribers, stuff like that. So uh, we greatly appreciate if you could do that. Right then, um, we are going to go on a break very shortly, but I want to bring you guys uh, this part of a Game Systems TV stream that we do. I haven't done very many here on Mixer. I think I've done about two. This is the third one. Right. Let's get it up. Uh, going back to some of the deals we've got here on gamesystems.co.uk. We have to go through uh, some of these. Get them up. Uh, we've got Overwatch on offer. Um, let me just get this up. Overwatch is currently uh, 33.99 on Xbox One and oh, actually, hang on, let me just do that bit again. Uh, <laughs> it's currently 40 pound on Xbox One. I think it's cheaper on uh, PS4. Yeah, it's 33.99 on PS4. So it's six pounds cheaper for the PS4 gamers. It's weird, like I said, PS4 tends to be more expensive on some games and cheaper on others. And uh, this way it's the other way around. It's cheaper to get it on PS4 than it is on Xbox One. I don't know, it all depends on our trade prices, which is why we price towards what prices that we're given uh, by the publishers and developers and stuff like that. So unfortunately, yeah, it is a bit more expensive on Xbox One than it is on PS4, but we have got an offer on where you can trade in selected games and get it cheaper. So on uh, Xbox, sorry, on uh, PS4, you can get it for about somewhere between 25 and 30 pound, depending on what games you're trading in. So it's definitely worth obviously trading in if you don't play those games anymore and you just want to get rid of them, get rid of them and you can get Overwatch a lot cheaper. There is a Game of the Year edition of Overwatch out at the moment which has all the extra bits but that's quite pricey at the moment, it's just under £50. So you can get the Origins uh, edition just half the price if you trade in. So. It depends what you want to do. If you want those extra bits, if you're not interested in those extra bits, like I said, we started doing Overwatch without those extra bits. So, <laughs> to me, it wouldn't really matter. You've got to play Overwatch. If you haven't got Overwatch, you've got to get Overwatch. And whatever that is the cheapest way of getting Overwatch, get it because it's definitely a game worth investing in. 
Uh, we've got arms on switch, which is also been reduced. I'm just going to find the price for that. Nothing's wrong. Well, right, these bits aren't on the home page at the moment. Ah, it's not in that bit. Hang on a second. This is a bit of an inconvenience. So just try and rummage around and find everything. Uh, switch. Uh, sorry, arms on switch is currently forty nine forty nine. It's supposed to be quite a popular game on the switch, and it being a switch game, it's no surprising how you know expensive the game is. is for some reason, these games on switch are quite expensive. Don't ask me why, you can ask Nintendo that. Okay, this is Chris Goss on hospital. Right, we've got um, to you live from the beautiful Italian Horizon Zero Dawn. It's raining. <laughs> That's on offer at the moment. The I could have in London get for this. A voice for that. Well, hope the weather isn't dampening your fun. Keep it here for music to keep your spirits up. Hospital records. Oh, where is it? Uh, it's currently 32.76 on PS4, which is a good price because it comes with the extra bits like the bonus DLC that you get for it, and uh, it's the launch edition. So you get the bonus DLC plus you get one of these art books, which I have next to me right here. Uh, let me just get that out. Yeah, it's got these art cards. There's uh, the protagonist. I don't know her name, and there's also some nice pictures of. Um, some enemies and some of the uh, landscape of the game. Uh, they're quite rare now to get all of these um, launch editions. Of course, this come out on the 1st of March, so there's not many of the launch editions about, and plus, obviously, the condition is, and obviously, it's all brand new. So, £32.76 for Horizon Zero Dawn on PS4. The launch edition is actually a pretty good price, so you don't miss out on getting that. That will end obviously when the offer ends. Now, talking of Forza Horizon, we are on Forza Horizon 2, and we've just dropped the price of Forza Horizon 3 down again. It's uh, quite cheap at the moment, Forza Horizon 3. I was looking on Amazon how much um, Forza Horizon 3 was, and um, they are quite expensive. Now, Forza Horizon 3. On Amazon is currently 41.49. This is UK money. I don't know any other um, currencies, but did I say it was 41.49? It's currently 25.55 here in the UK on uh, Game Systems UK. I should say. Which is an amazing price. It's almost half the price of what Amazon is selling for. So you're saving yourself about twenty pound, no, nearly twenty pound on Amazon's price. And Amazon, you know, as everyone knows, Amazon itself is quite cheap and at a quite competitive price. And uh, we completely smashed their price. So definitely head over to GameSystems.co.uk if you want to get yourself a copy of Forza Horizon 3 for such a cheap price of £25.55. Now, Tekken 7. Oh, I've really got to get this game. And when I do, I've definitely got to do a stream of it. I love Tekken. I've been a fan of it since I first played it in 1997, I think it was. It was before I got a PlayStation. I got a PlayStation in 98. So, yeah, I think I played it Tekken 2. I never played the first one. Tekken 2 I played in 1997, which was the year after it came out. Tekken 2 came out in 1996. Uh, currently we're doing Tekken 7 
on Xbox One and PS4 for £37.71. And on PC, it's currently £29.99. And that's a lot cheaper than Amazon again. Amazon on oh, Xbox One is 41.45, and on PS4 is 43.99, and on PC is 38.75. So again, we're beating Amazon prices. So why shop at Amazon when you can shop at GameSystems.co.uk? No matter where it is in the world, you could be in the UK, could be America, Australia, Germany, yeah, I think any other country on top of my head, any country like that. You can still buy these games and get them for the same price. There is a bit of a uh, delivery charge, obviously, because obviously in other countries it costs us money to, to ship these out. So you will have to pay a small delivery charge, but still it will add up cheaper than what you can get it for on other sites. Now, Rocket League. We've got Rocket League on offer as well, and uh, you won't believe how, uh, how cheap this is. Oh, I'm searching for it on the site. Hang on a second. It is currently £5.4. The £5.4p brand new copy of Rocket League is. That is like half the price or I think half the price or maybe even double the price less than what it is digitally I think it's about 15 pound digital it's 10 pound cheaper to buy it physical from us here at gamesystems.co.uk and I know for a fact that's cheaper than Amazon it's 14.98 on Xbox one and 27 pound 90 on PS4 we sell it for £5.4p. You know where to go to get this game. Rocket League, obviously it's a good fun online game. You've got to try it at least. And why not pay just £5.4p and get yourself a copy of Rocket League here from gamesystems.co.uk. So I'm giving you loads of reasons here to shop here at gamesystems.co.uk. Get yourself uh, some bargain games, all brand new of course. Right then, I'm just going to read out some of the latest news, what's going on in the world right now. It's currently uh, 25 past 3 here in the UK on Sunday the 6th of August 2017. And these are currently what's going on in the world right now. Uh, one dead and two missing after a boat sinks in the English Channel. Uh, investigation opened over language policy at Sports Direct. Staff at the sporting goods retailer may only speak English even in personal conversations according to a page of its staff's handbook. Played Kamuru leader Leanne Wood has questioned whether this policy applies in Wales where Welsh is, in the, is the official language. The Welsh language commissioner has opened an investigation. Maybe they need to be a bit more you know, if they're in England, they speak in English. If they speak in Wales, they can speak in Welsh. You know, that's their native language. Uh, Jeremy Clarkson being treated for pneumonia in the Spanish hospital. Uh, during a family holiday in Mallorca, the Grand Tour host was admitted to hospital. Um, we have to see how the news develops on him and see if he's all right. Uh, Usain Bolt finishes third in his final 100-meter race. Uh, American Justin Gatlin beat Usain Bolt and Christian Coleman to win gold in the 100 meter dash at the World Athletics, Athletics Championships in London. Bear me one second, my son has woken up again and he's making a load of noise in the background. Like I said, I will have to go soon, I'm going to have to... Uh, sort my kids out 
Right, WWE's Eva Marie has announced her departure. The all red everything WWE superstar never returned to TV after her suspension in August 2016. So it's been a year, she hasn't been back on TV, and now she announces that she will be leaving WWE and they have parted ways. Uh, Man City fans dreaming after seeing. What the hell's his name? It begins with M. Mbappe? 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 Keep it hospital. Keep it Meet Sane, Sane. I don't know. These names, they always get me every single time. Uh, the, the Moroccan Wonder Kid met the uh, Manchester City midfielder uh, for a promotional photo shoot, but it hasn't stopped some City fans and one of their own players speculating. Do they think he's going to come to Man City or something? Uh, Arsenal fans unsure about Oxlade Chamberlain on the left. Uh, Playing a three-man defence against Chelsea, Arsene Wenger has named Oxlade, Champ uh, Oxlade Chamberlain uh, as left wing back uh, with summer signing Sayed Kalak. Oh, I don't know these names, they always get me all the time. Kalasanak. I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't know. I'm not in the football, so I, I get it wrong all the time with these names unless I really know how they're actually pronounced. Uh, both Ozil and Sanchez, Alexis Sanchez will miss the game. And the world pays tribute to Usain Bolt, though he's beaten by Justin Gatlin in his final 100 meter race. People are celebrating the Olympic champion and world record holder's outstanding career. He's retiring from athletics and he's only three years older than me. <coughs> I do apologize, I just have done that right into the microphone. I did put my hand over my mouth and I still actually got it down the microphone. I'm sorry about that. Especially if you're wearing headphones and you've got that voice in your ear then. It was actually louder than I thought it was going to be. Uh, but that is the latest uh, news and what's going on in the world right now here in the UK, 6th of August 2017. Right, gaming news then, let's find out um, what's going on in the world of gaming. Uh, Destiny 2 DLC could be as important as the main game, Activision says. Uh, game have tweeted, uh, the sploosh o -matic has arrived, uh, will you be claiming turf with this this weekend? with it this weekend. Uh, that's in Splatoon 2, it's a new little gun thing they got. And GameSeeker also tweeted, they're a rival independent retailer. They're an independent retailer like us. They are a bit bigger than us, and they do, you know, they are our rivals, but we still uh, shout them out. They That's a bit embarrassing, I've uh, <laughs> not keeping an eye on my controller. So I lost my background music. Um, GameSync have tweeted, uh, win Far Cry 5 on PS4 or Xbox One by entering our website. I do apologize for him screaming in the background, and I have to sort him out. Even the music can't drown out his uh, row that's coming from him. Right. Some more gaming news then. Bear me one second. I will get that up for you guys. Unfortunately, my son's grabbed hold of my hand and I can't use my right hand on the mouse. I'm going to try doing it with my left hand. But he's on my right, you see, so I've had to give him my right hand. And he's grabbed hold of my right hand, so now I can't. Well, I can, but it's a bit more difficult. Right then, latest news. Let's find out what's going on in the world of gaming. 
Uh, Ubisoft CEO talks huge potential of China, Vivendi threat, Xbox One X, and more. Uh, the Q and in a Q and A, um, Gamespot talked to Jivet Gillamon uh, in a wide-ranging interview. Uh, new Pokemon revealed for Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Uh, Ultra Sun Ultra Moon will feature new Dusk form of the Wolf Pokemon Lycanroc. Lik that's how you pronounce it. Uh, Dishonored, Sonnen Hill composer passes away at the age of 60. Daniel Lich died after battle with Sac... Uh, oh, hang on, something's popping from my screen. Uh, sarcoma. Uh, David Lich, uh, who composed the music for video games like Dishonored, Dishonored 2, Silent Hill, Book of Memories, and Silent Hill Downpour, has passed away. He died on Wednesday at his home in Topanga, Topanga Canyon, California, from sar Sarcoma, uh, just weeks after discovering it. He represents uh, sorry, his representative at Evolution Music Partners said he was just 60. Uh, Lich is perhaps best known for the music he composed for Showtime's Dexter. Uh, the music he composed for that show used non-traditional instruments such as knives and human bones to fit the theme of the show along with chamber orchestra. Uh, I am so saddened to hear of uh, Dan Parson, Dexter star Michael C. Hall said in a statement to The Hollywood Reporter, his music quite literally set the tone for Dexter. I'm fortunate to have known Dan as his talent was matched by his kindness. Uh, Lich did music for horror movies such as Hellraiser Bloodline and Stephen King movie Thinner and some of their Amityville Amityville yeah, it's all messed up because I can't say the word. And some of the Amateurville films. So, that is a bit of a shame though, to hear of his passing, but uh, yeah, the um, latest there uh, Dishonored and Dishonored 2, Silent Hill, Book of Memories, and Silent Hill Downpour composer Daniel Lich has died at the age of 60 at his home in California from Sarcoma. Uh, let us know your thoughts to this news uh, in the chat if you're watching this live or if you're watching this on YouTube. Please feel free obviously to get involved in the comment section uh, about this news as well. Right then, I have got to pop away now for a little quick break. Um, I've got a check on my kids and attend to them, make sure things are all right with them. I've got my boy here right next to me, I know he's your wife, but my daughter's gone a bit quiet, so I think I'll best go and check on her. I think she may have fallen asleep. Yeah, you can hear him, can't you? That's what I mean. he's right next to me. He's uh, a little fed up, I think, so I'm going to keep him busy for a little bit. But I'm going to, uh, like I said, go for a quick break. Uh, attend to him. I will be back to do some more Forza Horizon 2 streaming um, very shortly. Uh, for those of you that are watching live on Mixer right now, uh, please feel free to stick around. I'll be back in about 10 minutes' time uh, to do the next part of the stream. Unfortunately, it has to be about 10 minutes because there's about that how long it would take me to sort out the kids. So, um, yeah, about 10 minutes' time, I will be back to do some more Forza Horizon 2 stream here on Mixer. If you you don't want to sit there looking at the back end of this car and watching cars go past, whatever, then please feel free to go and check out the channel here on Mixer. There's no other videos to check out at the moment because they've all expired, but uh, you can check out any information that you want that's also on our channel as well, um, in regards to um, our channel streams and stuff like that. So please feel free, obviously, to go and check us out. It's mixer.com forward slash game systems TV. If you do want to check out some of the videos from Game Systems TV, then why not check out our Twitch channel? It's twitch.tv forward slash Game Systems TV. Uh, there's a load of uh, old videos from Game Systems TV in the highlight section, so head over to twitch.tv forward slash Game Systems TV 
and click on the highlight section and go and check out some of the best videos from Game Systems TV. If you want a bigger variety of games to check out or some of the stuff that we've had or done streams of on Mixer, then please head over to our YouTube channel. It's youtube.com forward slash Game Systems OD and check out those videos. While you're on any of our channels, whether you're on Mixer, Twitch or YouTube, please feel free to follow us here on Mixer. If you're enjoying the stream, you want to see more from Game Systems TV in the future, then please follow us on Mixer. If you want to follow us on Twitch, you want to see any of the streams that we do on Twitch, then follow us on Twitch. It's twitch.tv forward slash Game Systems TV. And if you want to subscribe to us on YouTube, because you want to check out some of the latest videos that we put up, then please subscribe to us on YouTube. It's youtube.com forward slash Game Systems OD. Well then, I will be back in about 10 minutes time to do the second part of Forza Horizon 2. So, bear with me about 10 minutes, I will be back to finish off the stream. So, hopefully, whatever you do, whether you stick around, or please feel free to stick around if you watch this live, or if you uh, want to check out some of the videos on our other channels, then please feel free to do so. But like I said, I will be back in about 10 minutes time, so I'll see you in a little bit.
Hello and welcome back to Game Systems TV. I do apologise for those of you that are watching live uh, for the wait. Uh, unfortunately, when I went on the break, I looked at the time and realised that it was time to feed my son. He had his food, pots and everything like that. And I went and got myself something to eat. And I saw his food pots and I looked at the time and I was like, oh, he was due food at, at uh, quarter to four. And it was nearly quarter to four, and I thought, oh, I'm going to have to do it now, because I don't really want to stop the stream again. So, while I had the break, I've just fed him. He's all fed, he's changed, he's, he should be all right. Uh, as my daughter, yeah, she was asleep. I said she was asleep. I thought she was, because she went very quiet. But, uh, yeah, she was actually asleep. So, I do apologise uh, for those of you that were watching the stream. And, obviously, I've disappeared for about 25 minutes, by the looks of it. I said it was only going to be 10 minutes, so it was actually 15 minutes longer than I said I was going to be. I do apologise, but like I said, obviously, I've got my kids here with me. I'm going to have to look after them because I've got no one else looking after them. So I'm doing a stream and looking after kids as well. So unfortunately, with my kids needing my attention, they have to come first, unfortunately. So I, well, I say unfortunately, but unfortunately for you guys, yes, they do. But... I'm sure you guys understand that you should always put your kids first before doing a stream. And like I said, my son needed feeding, and I had to go and check on my daughter. So obviously they took priority, so I had to sort them out first. Now they're sorted out, I can get back on the stream. So for those of you that are tuned into Game Systems TV, right here on Mixer that are watching live, thanks ever so much for your patience while you're waiting for me to come back. I said I have lost people. I think I've only got a couple of viewers now. Um, which I'm not surprised at, so I don't know how long people have been around for. But, um, yeah, unfortunately, um, I kept you guys waiting, um, which I've explained why. For those of you that are watching us on Mixer, if you enjoy our streams, or if you've seen earlier on what was going on in the stream, and you want to see more from Game Systems TV, you want to see more Forza Horizon 2, you want to see other games that we do, and other games that we will be bringing you in the future here on Mixer, then please follow us on Mixer, give us some support. We've had a follow today from Winter Spy, which I greatly appreciate. Those of you that tune in will see that in the chat, that Winter Spy has followed us, and also got involved in the chat, so... Uh, anyone that does actually want to support the stream, support us here at Game Systems TV on Mixer, then please follow us uh, just by clicking that follow button. No matter what platform you're on, then yeah, you can actually find the follow button. Just click it. If you want to check us out here on Mixer, check us out. It's a uh, Game Systems TV channel here on Mixer. Uh, this episode of Game Systems TV will be up on our channel, so you can check it out once we finish streaming it. Uh, there's also information about Game Systems TV that you can find on our Mixer channel, where it says about Game Systems TV. For those of you that want to check out more from Game Systems TV, the stuff that we've done previously in the past, since we first started streaming, uh, beginning of 2016, then you can find us on Twitch. It's twitch.tv forward slash game systems TV. Just find our channel there, and you will basically see um, the, in the highlights section all, well, not all of them, but most of our previous streams. This obviously will uh, give you a bit of an insight as to what you can find from Game Systems TV. The same as it will be on Mixer, though those are on Twitch. We do exactly the same on Mixer, and we'll be doing the same on Mixer. As you can see, it's only episode 7, so we've only done 7 streams on Mixer. So, yeah, we are much behind what we were doing on Twitch. I think we've done about 91 episodes on Twitch. And so we're playing a little bit of catch up. That's why we're doing a lot of streams on Mixer. But if you do watch Twitch, um, Twitch and you do have a Twitch account, then please follow us on Twitch. It's twitch.tv forward slash game systems TV. Uh, even though we're not streaming until later on in the month, you can still check out our channel at Game Systems TV on Twitch and you can find out some of the hosts that we are hosting on our channel. We also do hosts on Mixer as well. So stay tuned after the stream and we'll. We will be hosting someone, and I will tell you who we are hosting as well.
There we're on Mixer and Twitch. You can find us on YouTube. It's youtube.com forward slash game systems OD if you want to find all the previous streams, whether it's on Mixer or Twitch, all those streams get put over onto our YouTube channel. So if you want the latest videos that we upload onto YouTube, I think the last one we did we uploaded was yesterday actually. Let me just have a quick look on YouTube. Um, we have been doing some tinkering around with some of the videos on our YouTube channel. We even changed our name to Game Systems OD. It used to be Game Systems, but it's now Game Systems OD. Uh, yeah, it was a day ago. So it was yesterday we last uploaded a video onto our YouTube channel. So if you want to check us out on YouTube, head over to uh, youtube.com forward slash Game Systems OD and you'll find all the episodes of Game Systems TV on there. Obviously, I've recently we've been putting up Mixer streams. We've got four episodes of. Uh, mi well, four Mixer episodes already on our YouTube channels. Obviously, a few to go. Um, but we tend to wait for them to expire on Mixer and then we put them up. Uh, on Twitch, they get put up almost straight away. But uh, on Mixer, we will be doing them as and when like they've expired on our Mixer channel. Uh, because they don't, we don't have a highlight part on mixer like you do on twitch we can't keep hold of any of the videos so they will expire after 14 days like they do on twitch but like i said we can't put anything into highlights uh, and can't do any uploads on mixer something that mixer doesn't do which twitch does so uh maybe mixer need to think about that in the future there's things that mixer do that twitch don't and there's a lot of things that twitch do that mixer doesn't but then mixer is a fairly new platform it's only been rebranded a couple of months ago to mixer it used to be beam uh but then originally the whole platform wasn't around until early 2016 and by august 2016 uh, microsoft bought um mixer off the current well, the, the previous owner of Mixer slash Beam. My son's starting to stir now. He's had his food, but he's, uh, I think he wants to play. Unfortunately, <laughs> I can't play with him. Uh, he can't play games, so he gets a bit, he's probably getting a bit fed up. And you can probably hear him in the background there. Right. Uh, but as I was saying, with uh, YouTube, go and check out our YouTube channel. All of our stuff is on our YouTube channel. Like I said, if you do watch Mixer but don't watch Twitch and we do end up streaming on Twitch, you will miss out on those episodes and we won't be bringing the same episodes on to Mixer. So you will miss out on them unless you check them out on our YouTube channel and vice versa as well. What we show on Twitch will not be shown on Mixer and what we show on Mixer will not be shown on Twitch. So if you do have both platforms, if you do have an account with Twitch and Mixer, follow us on both platforms and you can watch us live. If you don't, uh, you can always, always uh, check us out on YouTube and check out on the uh, streams after we've streamed them. Like I said... Uh, the OD on Game Systems, OD stands for On Demand. Well, you can check us out on social media pages such as Facebook. It's facebook.com forward slash Game Systems UK. You can find out all the latest gaming information and news on our uh, Facebook page there. And... Uh, deals as well that we have on our website at gamesystems.co.uk and you can also check us out on Twitter it's twitter.com forward slash gamesystemsuk therefore you will find all the same information that you do on Facebook whether you have Facebook or Twitter if you have both like with Mixer and Twitch please follow us and like us on both platforms like say follow us and like us on Facebook and obviously follow us on Twitter as well and you can get kept up to date with all the latest information on what's going on in the world of gaming and deals and also we play guess the game on twitter so we basically take pictures of a game that we're playing and we ask you to guess the game you have to be precise to that like say if we're playing forza horizon 2 you need to say forza horizon 2 not forza horizon because it's not forza horizon it's forza horizon 2 so you have to be specific when you actually state what game it is uh, first to get the right answer, get, get um, two percent off of our website at gamesystems.co.uk. And as I read out earlier, some of the deals that we got going on are a lot cheaper than Amazon. Just imagine getting an extra two percent off. 
Yeah, it's, you'll be getting some stuff crazy money. Right then, for those of you watching us live on Mixer, please feel free to get involved in the chat today. I'd love to hear from you guys. I've heard from a Winter Spy earlier who uh, got involved in the chat, and uh, we had a little chat about um, what level I was on on Forza Horizon 2, uh, as well as he also added me as a friend here on Xbox. So, please feel free, obviously, to get involved in the chat if there's anything you want to talk about with regards to this game, this stream. Um, even if you just want to say hi, anything that, you, anything like that, please feel free, obviously, to get involved in the chat. Uh, for those of you that are watching this on YouTube, though you're not watching it live, you can still get involved in the comment section of this video. So if you enjoy this video and you want to make comments on it or anything you want to say with regards to this stream, the video, the game, please feel free, obviously, to get involved in the comment section. And also, if you do enjoy this, please give it the thumbs up, so give it the like here on YouTube and also uh, share it as well uh, with people. Give this game, sorry, give this stream a bit of exposure on YouTube. We love, obviously, to get um, the, our videos out and about a bit more uh, than what they currently are. So any you know, help we can get with, you know, from you guys by sharing our videos are uh, greatly appreciated. Right then, before I continue with the stream, I'm just going to go through some latest gaming news. I bought some earlier, uh, but I do have some more gaming news to uh, let you guys know about. Uh, Rainbow Six Siege passes 20 million players. Um, and 2.3 million people log on, log, sorry, 2.3 million people log in every day. I'm surprised it's that popular. I thought uh, Rainbow... No, it's not sorry. Uh, the Division would be uh, more popular than Rainbow Six. That's what everyone was banging on about at the time. But Rainbow Six Siege seems to be the, the, the better one by the looks of it. I haven't played either, so I can't comment on it. Uh, there's a giveaway on GameStop at the moment. Uh, Hands of the Gods Smite Tactics Starter Pack codes. Uh, they have 15,000 codes to unlock free cards. And they've also got a giveaway on gigantic skin codes and boosts uh, for PC. Uh, they have 5,000 codes for you to get 4 skins and 2 uh, boosts in gigantic. Um, GameStop has teamed up with Perfect World to give away 5,000 codes for their newest game, Gigantic, on PC. Each code unlocks four special skins and two boosts. The Gigantic Airship supply codes include Taito the Swift, uh, Alarian skin, uh, Beckett's Iron Tower skin, Margrave's Sir, Sir Oh, God. These names get me all the time. Why can't I just use normal names? Serape Betrayer skin. Um, Trips Citadel of Amber skin. One crown boost uh, equals 10 win. Um, one prestige boost, 10 win. Uh, this is an instant win, and you'll receive an email within 24 hours uh, with the code. Uh, Gigantic is a free-to-play strategic hero shooter developed by Motiga. Uh, gorgeously rendered, light-hearted and charming, Gigantic is for all types of gamers, pitting teams of five heroes and their massive guardians against other epic battles across a variety of maps. The game combines explosive combat with fast-paced teamwork, strat strategy and skill as players must work together and fight relentlessly to defeat the opposing guardian with spell, guns and swords. I do struggle with my words at the moment, I don't know what's going on. But uh, head over to GameSpots.com, uh, follow the links to that giveaway if you want to get involved and get your chance to win 5,000, well, be one of 5,000 to, uh, to get those two boosts skins 
in Gigantic. And uh, if anyone's playing Gigantic, please feel free obviously to get involved in the chat. Let us know your thoughts of the game or anything you or comment wise you want to leave with regards to um, Gigantic. And same in the chat, uh, sorry, same in the comment section on YouTube. You guys watching this on YouTube, um, what are your thoughts to the game of Gigantic if you're playing it? Um, let us know your thoughts or if you feel like you want to get the game let us know your thoughts in the comment section of this video right I'm going to quickly run through some more offers that we've got on our website here at gamesystems.co.uk right these are ending very soon so you need to uh, be very quick here to uh, to get these games um, Def Jam Icon on Xbox 360 is just two pound. Uh, again, an extra 10% off the game when you buy any other Xbox 360 game. That's exclusive to Game Systems and Gamers Club members only. Uh, Disney Pixar's Brave on Wii. Uh, last chance to get a hold of that. Uh, that's eleven pound sixty nine. Obviously, that won't be restocked once it's gone. And actually, to be honest, I think it's gone. It looks like it's out of stock, so that's already gone. Um, Donkey Kong Country Returns on Wii as well. This is pre-owned, just five pound, and the same offer. You can get it ten percent cheaper if you buy it with another Wii game. That's exclusive to Gamers Club members as well. Uh, Grey's Anatomy on Wii, that's just £5.84. Uh, Kane and Lynch Dead Men on Xbox 360 is just 85p, and you can get 10% off of it if you buy it with another Xbox 360 game, which is also uh, a Game Systems Gamers Club members only exclusive deal. Uh, Lego Indiana Jones 2 The Adventure Continues is just 15 29 and I don't think there's many left. By the so there's five left here. So uh, that's on PS3. So there's only three. Sorry, only five left on PS3. And Madagascar Three, Europe's Most Wanted on the Wii. Um, that is just one pound seventy-nine. Uh, and also your last chance to get hold of that before they go as well. Right then, I'm going to continue with the stream. Let's have a look then. I think. Um, is this starting to rain again? Ah, oh, where's my. Uh, oh, where's the garages? Why aren't the garages showing up on the map? That's, that really sucks. I don't know why that is. I was hoping to get to a garage so I can change my car, but I'm going to have to see if I can find them, because I don't even know where they are, they're not even showing up on the map now. I'm going to race him, and we're going to lose, and oh Christ, it's the S1, of course I'm going to lose, and he's a big guy as well. He's off. He's not messing about. He is off. I was hoping there was going to be some little uh, shortcuts I could take to try and cheat. The only way I can beat these guys is uh, cheating. In 400 meters, turn right. Turn right. Oh, I've completely overshot that. Right. I've completely lost this now. He's miles ahead, I've lost it. I'll, I didn't stand much of a chance anyway, but I've just kind of made it Turn worse right. for myself. 
should not have gone against him. I should have chose a better person to uh, face against him. Probably get told off for even trying to uh, Turn right. challenge him. Finally, there he is. Oh, I'm here. There's a garage somewhere around here. Do you reckon that's why? It's because that's there. Oh. I don't want to continue the road trip, I want to get in my garage. I can't get in the car that way. Oh, I have got a mini. There you go. Oh, God, I'm a bit stuck in, aren't I? I can't go in my garage because it will continue the road trip. And I don't want to continue the road trip. I want to go in my garage. Destination. Oh. What destination is that then? Ah, uh, there's a storm island then. It's down there. That's the expansion I don't have. Oh. Ah, there's one there. Go in and change my car now. I'm actually going to try and, well, I'm actually going to go back into my Hummer, actually. I don't know what I can do in this Hummer. Take a little trek. Oh, I don't know. I'll take a little trek. 
take a little trek here. Right, my boy is like really upset. <laughs> you can hear him in the background. I think he's getting a little bit fed up. Right, one second, I've got to attend to him. I think he's alright. He settled down a bit, so he's alright. I'm gonna do something to this Hummer. I think I'm fair. I'm gonna uh, get some mods and stuff and treat it to a bit of a uh, bit of a makeover. I know it's only a hammer, but still. In 400 meters, we started turn again. Left. Turn left. Hang on. Right, he was seriously unsettled then, I think, well, I think he's not going to settle down anymore, I think that's it, <laughs> I think my time has run out. Oh, I'm surprised he wanted me to cut through here. As I've got a hammer, why not? Oh, it needs a bit more power, I think this is struggling to get up there. Eh? Stuck on the rock now. Oh god, there's rocks everywhere. It's ruins, isn't it? Yeah, there's a way in I can get in. What's this way your destination? Me? Oh, this is a hard one by the looks of it.
time. Might take me a few attempts and I'll go home and see. Once I've familiarised myself with it, it should be alright. Oh, I can see this ain't going to be easy. to restart this. I don't feel like I'm actually going to do this in 120. In 400 meters, turn right. I'm going to try and cheat. I don't know where it's going to get me. Right into a tree where it looks like. I thought it might cut down some of the time. Oh, no way, I'm miles away. That's it, it's finished. Don't worry about it. This was a hard challenge. You should give it another... Yeah, I'm going to give it another go. The more you do it, the more you get familiarised... Uh, you familiarise yourself with it and then you can do it eventually. It's quite difficult not to hit any of the trees. In 400 meters, turn right. Now I'm going to try and cut the way without hitting any of the trees. Probably the only way to do it. Although I didn't get my angle right on that and I've just lost some time. better position than I was last time. I've already got the zero by now. Come on, flat out. Come on, flat out. Not going to make it. I am just short. Don't believe it. I was just short. So going through them trees then, I've got to be flat out. And I think I lost some time because I crashed into the wall. So they're the points that I lost time on. So, hopefully if I improve on that, and I think that was a bit of a slow start as well. And I'll just hit the rocks. And I'm going to restart it. I think that's already a bad start, so I don't think I'm going to do it. Trees about to go flat out. In four hundred well, meters, wasn't too turn bad. right. Oh no, didn't get the perfect line through the trees. Oh, I completely missed the road as well. Oh, I'll mess this up. I'll mess this up. I'm going to have to restart it. No chance then. The first set of trees I actually cleared really well, but the second lot, nah. I'm going to take the wrong route. Well, I'm going to 
route, as uh, Satnav says. Oh, 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 no, I've lost it again. I think the more I try, the worse I'm actually doing it. Oh, the harder I try, the worse I am at it. So close last time. Oh, oh no, I'm losing it again. I'm losing it. I've lost it. And I've lost all my speed now trying to, trying to control my car. In 400 meters, turn right. and avoid the trees that I can't see. Ah, oh, another lit. I think I've lost it now, my time's gone. No, I'm not gonna make it. That tree's just cost me. It's the right kind of course, but if you uh, go the same route through the trees, you know exactly where the trees are and you should be able to avoid them, but I don't seem to be going off-road at this right time. I've lost it already. Oh my god, this is, I think the more, like I said, the more I try at this, the, the worse I'm getting. Already. In four hundred meters, turn right. Can't see a thing. Oh, this is getting harder and harder. No, I've ruined it again because I flipped my car. I mean, the more I tried it, the worse I am definitely getting. I was actually better the first two times I tried this. The rest of it has just been a complete write-off. out of control. Oh no, I've just managed to get it. Oh no! The contr can't control the car. So the difficulty was hard on this, but it is actually quite hard. <sighs> God's sake. It might be one of them where I might have to uh, give up and come back at another time. I'll be able to do it then.
Ah, oh, see, I'll go around that tree like that and end up sending me wide. now. I probably wouldn't be so bad if I hit the tree if I didn't have to, if I didn't hit the tree I probably would have made it. There's no way I'm gonna make this. so close but I say it's that tree that did it for me if I can go through this right even clipping a tree I should be alright I should tell you what I might even go round the roadway round see if it actually if I can actually do it that way I thought the whole idea of cutting across might have actually uh, shaved some of the time off I think it's actually costing me time from hitting the tree. But if I didn't hit the tree, I'm sure it'd easily be able to do it. Ah, oh. cannot get that angle right. Don't worry, I will do it. I don't know when, but I will do it. I thought the whole idea of uh, you keep doing this was uh, to get better at it. I think I'm actually getting worse. Oh no, it's time to put a car on the way. Brilliant. In 400 meters, turn right. I'll go the road way round and I think my time's been cost by that car. Turn right. Massively overshot it. I'm gonna have to restart it. It's completely burned again. There's just too many bumps and obstacles, and it's just flying around all over the place. Snaking everywhere. In four hundred meters, turn right. Turn right. Well, the tree slowed me down a bit, which I probably would have done, and I probably would have braked over that bit so I don't overshoot the road. But that hasn't done me any better for time. I'm still at the same time at this point. No, I ain't gonna make it again. I don't believe it. How many times have I got to do this? Oh! Yeah. No! I don't believe it. I crossed the line at the time it ran out. You've got to be joking me. I've got to do it again. I thought that was very close. But it didn't let me have it. Oh, it must have been like split second after 120 for that not to go through. Well, I know what I've got to do now. All I've got to do is uh, 
do a tad quicker, and that's it. I think if I wasn't snaking the snow much, see, yeah, I can't even say it right now. Snaking it so much through this bit. This is better. This is better. Right, that's faster that right. time round. Turn right. Oh, the trees. Oh no! Oh, for God's sake! Forget it. <sighs> I've got to cut that corner so I don't lose speed. If I'm going to go round the corner, I will lose speed. I've got to cut straight across the corner, part of the road, and go straight, and that's it. Can't lose speed if I get breaking and go around the corners. And I did this bit better that time. Well, I'll try and do the same again. Put a snake in the car. Oh, he lost it. There's a car in the way again. Done in better that time. Right. Just gotta Turn avoid right. these trees. Oh, I've done it again, I've hit the same tree. No, I can't. It's, I've just got no speed. They know that you gotta you got to cut that corner. That's why they've got those trees there. I'm trying to ruin it for me, I think. Oh, for God's sake, I'm, it's really annoying me now. Some remind me of a game that I played that was really annoying me that time. Um, I haven't done it on Mixer, it was on Twitch where I was playing uh, Operation Flashpoint Dragon Rising. That wound me right up. Uh, that is actually on our also on YouTube as well. If you want to see me get a bit of a rage on. No, 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 the past In 400 meters, turn right. Oh no, there's cars in the way. Oh no, they're right in the way of my corner. Turn right. Still managed to hold it, but I think that's cost me some time. This is going to be very close. One car faster. I don't think I'm gonna do it. Oh no! It's done it again! As I cross the line. Yeah. It's just that like split second I lose on that corner. That's what cost me. Oh no, oh, it's just bounced. Oh, I think I've just got hold of that. Yes, and landed it. In 400 meters, turn right. Oh, I've just turn right. cut too much. Oh, oh no. Cut too much. I'm trying to get around that car as well. I just about held it through the first bit as well. I think it's 
frustrating to watch, it's even more frustrating to play. How do you think I'm feeling right now? Oh no, it just bounced again. Oh, I can't have anything slow me down, Oz. I cannot do it. Anything that slows me down, it will not. I will not make it. Oh no, that was a bit of a slow start, so I didn't have my foot on the accelerator. I oh, saw my finger on the trigger. Just saying. Bad. There's a car on the way again. Turn right. No, it's gone flying off. Oh no, I need to cut more of a corner than that. Oh, this is starting to get really frustrating now. God, that was all right until that, but it just bounced. I couldn't even turn. You sure, this is hard. You sure, this ain't like very hard. at that post I'm mean, better off come on oh I think I might do this I'm a second faster at that point than I was last time the last time I got that point come on let's do it let's do it yes oh, yes 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 Done it. Oh my god. Thank you guys for your patience <laughs> while I did that. That was a pain in the ass. I was actually starting to lose it a bit then. I was going to go, oh god, this is taking too long. I need to hurry up. I don't know how many attempts that was. It was a few there, wasn't it? I'll watch it back and I'll count. Must be about 15 or 16 attempts. That's what I'm saying. Um, does that include the restarts? Don't know. Oh, 30. 30 or something like that. Oh, there's a board there. I thought I saw something. Get that one on there. You leveled up. Money or car? Money or car? A little bit of money.
Probably this track should lead me to a road. God, it's quite difficult to see. And I'm starting to One lose control of my hammer. The area. I've marked their position on your GPS. If you'd like to challenge them to a head-to-head. -head. No, I do not want to challenge that. I will not beat that in this. Maybe something a bit slower. Let's get some music on, shall we? Went a bit, a bit quiet then, I thought, oh, let's get some music on, liven it up a bit. Plow through that car and I didn't even notice it. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. If there's any more cars, I'm just plow through. I've done that back in this, I need to do that. Not really anyone around the challenge either. I suppose it's less about because it's not. Destruction there. I am in a hammer after all. There's a little discount board there. Turn around when it is safe to do so. In 400 meters, turn left. Face of Reno. Oh, morning's coming, left. so there's going to be more cars on the road. In 200 meters, 
Turn right. All oh, these hard ones to challenge. Turn right. And easy ones. And a hammer after all. Destination. There it is. Oh, here do. Come back. Actually, probably a bit too fast for me. Can't keep up with him, he's obviously too fast for me. Mine's a D-class, but it is the higher end of a D-class. Let's hope there's uh, some shortcuts I can take on this track, on this point-to-point, uh, -point because uh, I ain't going to be able to do it any other way. I saw that bend there, I thought, oh, maybe I'll be able to cut across that, but it's not. It's rocks and stuff, so I can't cut across there. pulling away from me but I just can't seem to catch up Why I chose that to Pay attention to the difficulty rating of festival racers before you challenge them. Oh, shut up, I can see that. So someone get it right. Come on, basically. I'm going to find someone else. There's he disappeared. Want him? You have arrived at your destination. Where you going, mate? Where you going? Hey, come back. Well, that might be a fair challenge. Can't 
get close enough to him. Might be, oh, I don't know, he's a bit more powerful than I am. Oh, a bit of a bad start there, probably right there in that spot. Or might be a bit of off-roading then. Definitely would have helped me out though. He's gone, isn't he? He's more gone than the Porsche was. And I was facing against a Porsche, and I swear the Porsche had a higher rating than him. He struggled up that hill, and I've caught up because of that. Oh no, there's a wall! I definitely would have had him if there was no walls. In 400 meters, turn left. Now this Hummer just ain't got nothing going for it to uh, challenge anyone. Turn left. Even if I get some performance upgrades for it, then uh, it'd be a lot better uh, at the moment. Not do any head to heads. I mean, I lost that one. Oh, he's off down there. I'm going straight on. See you there, mate. Thanks for beating me. Challenges, not until I get. I uh, think he's going to be a bit more faster. Although he's only in a Civic, he's only a pro driver, not a highly skilled driver. Seafront, where festivals going on. I oh, just imagine, you know, this. I don't know. This probably is will. This probably does happen. But just imagine going to one of these in a country like this, weather like this, on the seafront, cars, festivals, music. You know, oh, been to. Similar things, not quite the same.
Alright, while I'm there. Dude, come on in. How can I help? Hmm, I can help by uh sorting out my escort. to it. Yeah, and there she is. There's my escort. Uh, this is the only car I've actually got modifications on. The rest of the cars, I ain't even touched. Alright then, um, I'm going to go back to actually go back to my cure, I think. You guys can have a quick look around my cure if you like, uh, while I just talk to you guys. Um, this is about it for the stream now. This is coming to the end of the stream. Uh, thanks ever so much for you guys that have watched the stream uh, throughout the uh, over three hours that we've been on for. Um, I do apologise for the bits in the middle, which I kept you guys waiting. Uh, like I said. Uh, I've had to look after my kid through this stream and I thought it might be a bit challenging and to be honest my kids have actually done me proud they've been really well behaved so obviously my son was a little bit niggly at times but then you know he's only five months old so you know if I hadn't said my kids were here you probably wouldn't have known though you did hear my son earlier but yeah he's been he's been pretty good and he's settled now and to be honest I can't leave him for much longer so I've really got to go and uh, attend to them so um, that, I'm going to have to end the stream here unfortunately you guys but if you want to see more from Game Systems TV if you enjoyed this stream uh, please tune into the next episode of Game Systems TV here on Mixer we are doing another one on Mixer it is episode 8 and there will be the last episode of Game Systems TV on Mixer for a while because I said we have to go back and do some more streams on Twitch uh, like we've told our Twitch followers so um, we will be going back to Twitch at the end of the month but we have got one more stream we will be doing 
on Mixer. Now, I can't tell you which game we will be playing because it is going to be a brand new game we haven't done on Mixer before and we haven't even done it on Twitch either. But you guys will be the first to see it on Mixer as we play it. We will continue the playthrough of that game on Twitch, but it is coming on Mixer first. Um, I haven't decided which game it is. I've got to choose. I've got to have a look. Oh, yes, I did actually. Actually, I can't remember. <laughs> it's we're doing rhyme, and there's another game, and I can't remember. But I can't remember if we're doing rhyme first. Yeah, I think we're doing rhyme first. So I think it's rhyme we're going to be bringing to um, mixer. I just remembered rhyme. I can't remember the other one. I'm going to have to look it up. It's uh, all on the computer, so I have to look through it. But um, I, c I cannot remember what the games were. But Rhyme, we will be bringing to um, Mixer for the first time. We've never played Rhyme before. I've never played Rhyme before. Um, I'm going to have to get it and get it installed. Um, but until then, like I said, I need to sort out the Xbox Live Gold. I've got no Xbox Live Gold on the Xbox. And the hard drive is completely full up. There's not even a gig left of it. It's just megabytes left on this hard drive. Now it's completely rammed. And so I'm going to have to uh, get another hard drive for it. So there's another hard drive and uh, Xbox Live Gold. So that's a bit of money to spend. But uh, like I said, we are a business. We do have all these things anyway. So, But it still costs the business money to obviously have this and to, to stream it. So we have to pay for all the games. Even though it come, goes for the business, the business still has to pay for these games. So... Um, yeah, doing these streams does actually cost us money, so um, I'll leave it at that. If you want to feel free to donate, then please feel free to do so. And you can also support us uh, money wise just by buying these games uh, from our website. So if you liked Forza Horizon 2 and you want to purchase Forza Horizon 2, you can actually get the game from our website. Now, if you watch this on YouTube, there may be a link to the website either on screen now by pressing the I button in the top right hand corner or uh, on the end screen right at the end of this video. Now you have to wait for the last 20 seconds of this video. Look how long the video is and then skip to the last 20 seconds you'll see an end screen and click on it. It will show you the latest videos from Game Systems TV. There either may be um, another video on the right hand, top right hand corner It'll either be a subscribe or it'll be a link to the website. Uh, we change it. We don't have all the same ones that's on the same video. So we do change it around. So I can't even tell you what is actually going to be uh, in the top right hand corner. But the bottom two corners I can say. The bottom left hand corner is a previous episode of Game Systems TV. Which will be Borderlands 2. Uh, Mixer episode 6. And... In the bottom right hand corner will be um, the next episode, which will be Rhyme. Uh, that's Game Systems TV Mixer episode 8. So if you want to see the next episode of Game Systems TV, wait till the end screen comes on. Click on the bottom right hand corner um, end screen and it will uh, take you to the next episode of Game Systems TV. But for those of you here on Mixer, Thanks for checking us out live and getting involved in the stream if you have done and also involved in the chat as well. Uh, if you have enjoyed our episodes of Game Systems TV, you have enjoyed the stream and you want to see the next episode of Game Systems TV where we will be doing Rhyme on Mixer episode 8, then please follow us on our channel. It's mixer.com forward slash Game Systems TV and uh, click the follow button and you'll get the notification as to when we go live with that stream. Um, I can't. I, I'm not sure what it will be next week. It may be the week after, but uh, you, if you follow us, then you'll know exactly when we're streaming it. And in the meantime, if you have just tuned in, unfortunately we have come to the end of the stream. But check out our channel, and you can watch this episode of Game Systems TV from the very beginning. You can skip to your best bits or bits that you want to see on this episode as well. So um, click on the video in the past broadcast section is on the left hand side next to about game systems tv you can also check us out on twitch we're on twitch at twitch.tv forward slash game systems tv 
Uh, you can check out all the um, previous videos that we've done over the last year and a half. They're all up there on our Twitch highlights. Uh, we're also going back to streaming on Twitch after the next episode of Game Systems TV as well here on Mixer. So we've got one more episode of Game Systems TV on Mixer and then we will be going back to Twitch. So make sure you head over to Twitch and follow us on Twitch to make sure you ha get the notifications as to when we will be doing that stream on Twitch, which should be at the end of the month. So if you want to support us here at Game Systems TV, you can support us here on Mixer. It's mixer.com forward slash Game Systems TV. Don't forget to click the follow button. And you can also support us on Twitch, which is twitch.tv forward slash Game Systems TV. And as I said, don't forget to click the button, the follow button, I should say. You can also check us out on YouTube on our rebranded Game Systems On Demand uh, channel where we put all of our streams, whether it's from Mixer or Twitch, they all go up onto YouTube. So if you haven't been able to watch our streams live, you can actually watch them on demand at a time that suits you, wherever you want to watch it. Um, and whatever episode you want to watch, whatever game you want to see, they're all on our YouTube channel. We've got over 140 videos on our YouTube channel right now there's about over a hundred of them uh, live streams some of them are trailers from years ago but there's about 134 streams on our channel so um, go and check out our YouTube channel youtube.com forward slash game systems OD Check out the videos on there and don't forget as well to subscribe to our YouTube channel and obviously when we do upload our videos from Mixer and Twitch they will be on there. So if you do watch Mixer but you don't watch Twitch you will miss out on the episodes of Game Systems TV that we do on Twitch. So if you do like I said, watch Mixer and don't watch Twitch you will miss out on the Twitch streams. Uh, therefore if you subscribe to us on YouTube you won't miss out on them. You'll see them, but you won't see them live. They will be recorded live, but they won't be live playing right at that time. It's not a live stream. So you can still check us out on YouTube. You can still see all those videos, whether you follow us on Twitch or Mixer or watch us on Mix or Twitch, uh, Mixer or Twitch. I'm getting them all mixed up now. I'm saying so many names. I'm getting them all mixed up. But yeah, you can find all those videos on our YouTube channel. And like I said, subscribe to us on YouTube, support the channel, and support us here at Game Systems TV and Game Systems OD. And you'll get them to your subscription box as soon as we upload them. The last one we uploaded was a day ago, so it was yesterday, uh, which was um, Assassin's Creed Chronicles China, uh, which we streamed on Mixer. Uh, but that's available now on our YouTube channel if you want to check it out. As soon as they expire on Mixer, we end up chucking them onto uh, YouTube. So uh, you guys can catch up with them on our YouTube channel. You can also check us out on social media as well. Uh, it's Facebook, facebook.com forward slash Game Systems UK. Just knock my control on the floor. Uh, you can check out that and it gives you all the latest gaming news, other gaming stuff as well as um, offers as well that we have on our website at gamesystems.co.uk. I read out some earlier, some fantastic offers we've got on there at the moment and even beating Amazon by loads. I mean, there are, I'll tell you some more in a little bit later but uh, there's prices on there that you, you can't even get anywhere cheaper than any retailer in this country. I'm not sure about any other countries, but I know for a fact that we price them based on other retailers in the country, whether they be independent retailers or whether they be major retailers like Game and Amazon, Shop2, places like that. We tend to beat their prices. Uh, only on selected items, though. Some items we just can't get a better price from, so unfortunately we can't <laughs> end up beating them. But you can get some great prices on our website. If you want to be the first to hear about them, then you need to follow us on our social media pages, uh, like Facebook, facebook.com forward slash Game Systems UK. Don't forget to follow us and give us a like if you want to see all those posts as soon as we post out all the latest deals. 
Likewise with Twitter then, you can follow us on Twitter as twitter.com forward slash Game Systems UK. Get all the latest gaming news, gaming information, as well as deals as well we have on our website. So same as it is on Facebook. If you do have Facebook and you do have Twitter, make sure you support us on both platforms. If you have one or the other, then support us on the platform that you have. Uh, we also play Guess the Game as well. We take pictures of games that we play, put them up on Twitter, and you just need to guess what the game is. You've got to be specific. If it's Forza Horizon 2 we're showing, you've got to guess Forza Horizon 2. You can't just say Forza Horizon because that leads on to it being the first one. If we're playing the second one, it's not the first one. So you need to make sure you put in Forza Horizon 2, Forza Horizon 3, or Forza Horizon whatever one that it is that you think it is. If you do guess it right and you are the first one to guess it right, you will get 2% off your next order at gamesystems.co.uk. And if you want to check us out on Twitter and you want to follow us on Twitter, it's twitter.com forward slash gamesystemsuk. I right, just want to give a shout out and a thanks to everyone who got involved in the chat today. Uh, that's you, Winter Spy. Thanks ever so much for getting involved in the chat and having a quick chat. And also, friend of me on Xbox One. If you want to friend me on Xbox One, same would be, it would be the same with Xbox 360 because I do play Xbox 360 as well. So, uh, the gamer tag is Sonic Pain 24. There it is in the chat. If you want to uh, add me as a friend on Xbox Live, then put that, well, search for that gamer tag as you see it in the chat right now. And uh, Winter Spy couldn't find it earlier because though he's spelling it right, it's probably not got the caps in the right place, and obviously there's a space between Sonic and Pain. So. You need to make sure you obviously you get the, the game of tags spelt exactly right. Otherwise it won't find me. And for those of you that are watching this on YouTube as well, please feel free obviously to leave your comments in this video. If you've enjoyed this video, you want to see more from Game Systems TV, uh, you got anything to say about the game, the stream, our channel videos, anything like that, any comments you want to leave, um, please. Sorry, excuse me. <laughs> I've been drinking, this give me a bit, coming up a little bit. Um, yeah, please feel free, obviously, to leave your comments on this video in the comment section down below. And if you do enjoy this video, give it the thumbs up and also share it as well. We greatly appreciate the exposure our videos get on YouTube and we. Yeah, we're doing alright on Mixer and we're doing alright on Twitch. We're doing better on Twitch than we are on any other platform. That's because we've been doing Twitch longer. Though we've had our YouTube page longer than we've had our Twitch page. And our Mixer page is the one we've only had for three months. And it's all, we've almost got more followers on our Mixer channel than we have on our YouTube channel, which we've had for years. So our YouTube channel definitely needs more support from you guys. So any support you can give us, whether it's subscribe or share our videos, please do. We greatly appreciate it. And what we do here at Game Systems TV, if you follow us on Mixer, we do give you a follow back. So if you support our channel, we give you a support back. And uh, you can, we can also host your channels as well, whether it being on Mixer on, uh, or Twitch. So if you follow us, then we do host your channel just by you following us. So if you want us to host it, then all you got to do is follow. And obviously we support everyone who follows us and supports us. Same with uh, YouTube as well. We do subscribe back to the channels that subscribe to us. As long as you make it visible, if you hide your channel, so you subscribe to us and we can't see that you've subscribed to us we can't subscribe to you back because we don't know who subscribed to us we've got 11 subscribers on youtube currently and 
not all 11. There's only about seven that we can see. So there's a few people that subscribe to us, so we don't know who subscribed to us, so we can't even subscribe back to them. So make sure you don't hide the fact that you're subscribing to us, otherwise you can't get a sus subscription back. So make sure, obviously, you keep that visible. Right then, that about wraps things up. But there is one thing that I've actually forgot to do, and that's to do the charts. I'm going to quickly run through the charts here uh, from this week and let you guys know what is in the top 10 in the UK charts week ending the 29th of July. So this was uh, last sun last Saturday. Sorry, it's not refreshed until tomorrow. Uh, last week's number one then was Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. Uh, last week's number two it was Splatoon 2. Last week's number three was Grand Theft Auto 5. Last week's number four was Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. And last week's number five was Overwatch. Let's see where they got this week. Right then, up seven places to number 10 is Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. Down one to number nine is FIFA 17. A new entry for Rugby League Live 4 at number eight. And another new entry at number seven for Metopia. Up ten places to number six is Dishonored 2. Up seven places to number five is Doom. Up five places to number four is Fallout 4. And the non-mover for Grand Theft Auto 5 at number three. That means there's another non-mover at number two for Splatoon 2. And still retaining the top spot at number one is Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy. That's doing really well. And Activision have announced that they will be bringing back some old products. Products? Projects. Um, thanks to the success of Crash Bandicoot Trilogy. Now, I'm going to go and play... Crash Bandicoot on the PlayStation. I've got the disc right here. Yeah. Yeah, that's me tapping the PlayStation disc. I'm going to play it in its true form, how it was actually originally made and how I played it 20 years ago. I don't know if I want to play it how it is now. It must look amazing now. But it's not how I remember it. So, in that, with that... I'm just saying I'm not going to play the new version. I'm going to play the old version. Uh, just missing out on the top 10 then. It shot up the chart. So it's gone up uh, eight places to number 11. That's Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, we've currently got an offer. You can help that get back into the top 10 as we've got it on offer. Just slipping out the charts to number 12 is Lego Worlds. Um, where else we also slipping out the charts down 10 places to number 16 is The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. It looks like Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild has swapped places with Dishonored 2. Because Dishonored 2 has gone up 10 places and Zelda has gone down 10 places. Also slipping out the charts to number 17 is Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. Also slipping down to number 18, Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Also slipping out the charts there to number 24. Last week's number 7 is Final Fantasy 13, The Zodiac Age. Uh, a re-entry then for The Witcher 3, Wild Hunt, Game of the Year edition at number 26. Another re-entry at number 27 for For Honor. And massively slipping down, I'm surprised at this. Uh, from 5 to number 28 is Overwatch. That's what happened to Overwatch. Um, new entry then at number 29 for Hey Pikmin. And a re-entry for Call of Duty Modern Warfare Remastered at number 31. And where the hell has this come from? Slipping into the charts at number 40. Whether this is new or whether this is a uh, re-entry is Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Gold Edition. I didn't even know there was a Gold Edition. Okay, well, it's in the charts. Just in, just made it into the charts. Mm. 
Right then, I'll quickly run through some offers before I let you guys go and before I've got to attend to my children. But um, Madden NFL 11, last chance to get this on offer is £11.70. Well, I say it's the last chance, it's already gone. It's on Xbox 360, it's gone now. Don't worry about it. Um, Mario Kart Wii with the wheel is just £12 on Wii, of course. Uh, that's pre-owned and if you buy it with another Wii game you get 10% off of it uh, but this is only exclusive to Game Systems Gamers Club members last chance then to get Pets Monkey Madness on the Wii for just £9 and we have PlayStation 2 consoles unboxed you can get the console just on its own for £40, but you can get 10% off of it if you're a Game Systems Gamers Club member, but you have to buy a game with it and get 10% off of it. Or you can get this PlayStation 2 console bundle uh, unboxed with free games of your choice for just £60. And obviously, again, it's a Gamers Club members offer where you get an extra 10% off should you buy a PlayStation 2 game with it. Uh, we have a PlayStation 2 game on offer, it's Rugby 2004. Um, again, this is a Game Systems Gamers Club members offer where you get 10% off if you buy it with another PlayStation 2 game. It's currently £3.25. And yeah, that's it. Yeah, we'll leave it there. There is others. If you want to check out more offers and even new offers that are coming on right now, then head over to our website at gamesystems.co.uk and search. Well, don't even have to search for anything. So just look on the home page and you'll find everything right there. Right, thanks ever so much for you guys that have been tuning in and watched this episode of Game Systems TV live right here on Mixer. Greatly appreciate you guys taking the time out today on this Sunday afternoon here in the UK or Sunday morning it is wherever you guys are but thanks ever so much for taking the last three hours out to, well three and a half hours I think it is now to go and check out our stream of Forza Horizon 2 this is the last Forza Horizon 2 we're going to bring here on Mixer for a little while so hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you have tuned in and you have missed it please feel free to go and check out our channel it's mixer.com forward slash game systems UK and click on the past broadcast video and it will show from the very beginning if you want to see more from game systems tv please feel free to click the follow button and like i said you know check out the videos that we have on our mixer channel or twitch while you wait for our next stream to appear here on mixer which we will be doing rhyme and game systems tv episode eight but I'll say in the meantime, you can check out our Twitch channel. It's twitch.tv forward slash Game Systems TV. Uh, check out all the highlighted videos on our channel there. Or you can check us out on YouTube. It's youtube.com forward slash Game Systems OD. And I said there's over 100 streamed videos on our YouTube channel to keep you guys entertained until we do our next episode of Game Systems TV here on Mixer. And please obviously support our channels as well. Support us here on Mixer. It's mixer.com forward slash game systems TV. Click the follow button. We greatly appreciate the follow. We even give you a follow back to say thanks for follow. And also on Twitch as well. Twitch.tv forward slash game systems TV. Click the follow button. Turn your notifications on. Make sure you know when we're streaming next on Twitch. And like I said, give us a follow and support our channel. And we will give you a follow back and a support. And also, don't forget as well to subscribe to us on YouTube. It's youtube.com forward slash game systems OD. Right. Uh, for those of you that are watching on YouTube, you can, well, in a second, will pop up on the end screen 20 seconds before the end of links to other videos or the previous video. The next video, or even our latest stream, is all on there. There's a, and also, uh, or maybe I don't know yet. Um, uh, the link to the channel, uh, sorry, link to our website, I should say. Uh, so please 
wait 20 seconds or even skip to the 20 last 20 seconds of this video and uh, check out those videos and stuff at the end of this video so until the next episode of game systems tv I hope you guys take care and I will see you in the next episode of Game Systems TV. But for now, for those of you guys that are watching on Mixer, stay tuned. I'm going to feed in uh, Tim Dub 151 as we're going to host now. He's currently playing Tom Clancy's The Division. Uh, so stay tuned um, and he will appear up on the channel. So until our next episode of Game Systems TV, take care and I'll see you in the next episode where we will be doing Rhyme here on Game Systems TV, Episode 8 on Mixer.